happy Wednesday. We are in the middle of the week. Shall I say? Y'all are almost through with the week. It's hump day. Happy hump day. Happy hump day, everybody. Happy, happy hump day. Welcome to my channel. This is Unique B12. If you guys are new here, go ahead. Hit the subscribe button. Go ahead. And hit the what? The bell over there. You see that bell over there? Go ahead and hit it when you'll know that I am posting a video. It will come up on your screen. You won't miss nothing. You won't be lost when I go to videos and be saying this and that and that. And the third, go ahead and join the family. We are the Get In Crew. Once again, we are the Get In Crew. So welcome. We are here today with KLC. I know the bag says or looks like. What it looks like, Taco Bell, <laughs> open late, but uh, it's KLC in here. The kids and them, they had mostly Taco Bell in there, so that's why the bag is the Taco Bell, but it was Taco Bell slash KLC, so I ordered KLC. They ordered Taco Bell, Taco Hell I call it for me, but um, let's get in here to whatever we have to get done in here. So, um... We got some sauces and stuff over here. You know. Taco Bell, like I told you. Live in a vida mito. Live in a vida mito. Current mood. Hot. I think that sauce is pretty good though. And they did not give me a fork. As usual. They gave me my bowl. They left out my cookie. Now I see why my son don't work there no more. So I put a fork in here for myself. And like I said, I wanted the cookie because the cookies be really good. And I be wanting that cookie when I want to eat a snack or something, especially when I'm, you know, out and about working because, you know, I'm sitting in the car mostly. So... Oh well. KLC bowl. There you go, guys. This is the new mac and cheese. And I got the spicy once again. It's never a surprise. When I order things, you will hear spicy. Sometimes I will not order spicy, but it's very seldom you'll actually see me not order it. But yeah, I have this, of course, soda. I don't know you like golly, twice in the uh a month, like two week expansion. I don't know. It is what it is. You know? I got a Pepsi too. So. Y'all know Pepsi tastes like diesel. <laughs> Let me get a uh, a napkin. So I got a napkin because they didn't give us no napkins. I don't know what they had up their sleeve or what was up their butt today. But um, his manager even was at the register at the window, drive the window. So I knew something was up. So let's get into here, you guys. Let's get in here. Let's get in there. Okay, it look like popcorn chicken with macaroni and cheese. They drizzled a little bit more cheese on there, look like. Oh. It don't smell spicy. Y'all get in there. Y'all want some? Y'all can have the first bite too. Because I don't know what to expect here. Darn, I should have got my sour cream. I need some sour cream, y'all. Hold on. I'll be right back. So I am back. I got my sour cream. And also, I'm going to use one of these packets. The hot. Sauce right here, well, hot, you know, the, the little sauce you put on your tacos, the hot nacho sauce. They say too good to be, too good to not be true. Too good not to be true. Too good to be true. They packets look different too now. Like they put this little live message. That moment when, that moment when, I can't even think of a moment. I don't know how I went blank. In the car, we was on a roll. I was like, I got so many stories to tell you guys. If I, you know, really wanted to share some stories, you guys would be rolling. Makes me happy. 
What makes me happy is food. So my current mood right here, hungry. <laughs> All right, guys. I got some sour cream over here. I didn't think you needed to see that, but I'm going to alternate this trillium on one side, and then I'm going to try it regular without no sour cream. So here you go. I got some chicken. Yeah, they put some extra cheese on here. You can tell. Let me see if it's going to give me that little drizzle. Damn. And it's still hot. It don't give me that nice, you know, cheesy feel, that drizzle right there. I don't see that right there. So, hold on. All right, y'all. Here you go. I want y'all to spill it all on the table. Y'all get the first bite. I'm sharing with you. Go ahead. Y'all. Okay. Whew. Mm-hmm. And like I said, this is without the sour cream. Just the chicken bites and the macaroni and cheese. Then the chicken is spicy. I'm not gonna need that spice. Uh-uh. This spicy. Woo. Woo. That's hot. And I like hot stuff now. See they got cheese on here, but like I said, it's not that stringy cheese. But there's some cheese on here. With this chicken. It's spicy, so my nose running. Y'all see me sniffing? Y'all know why. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Okay. I told you it's spicy now. Woo. Let's try it with the sour cream. Maybe it'll cool it down. Mm. Uh, uh. I've never been a fan of their macaroni and cheese. That's to let y'all know. I don't think nothing special is about nothing special they have about this macaroni and cheese. Besides, I'm adding more cheese to it. Mm. Nothing quite special, extravagant about it at all. But I can say it's pretty good. Mm. And get some chicken. Mm -hmm. I'm telling y'all, boy. This is a good Wednesday. Y'all just want the macaroni? Macaroni. Oh. Y'all see that? I don't know if y'all can see that, but y'all see that? That's that spice from the the chicken bites they got on here. Like it's it really has some kick to it with the spice. Make you want to slap your mama. I swear, boy. Mm, mm, mm. Let me give y'all another one right here. Y'all want some some sour cream? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't even do a thumbnail, boy. I don't even think it's gonna catch it. And if you see my videos a little off with the, the thumbnail. Because my laptop is broke now. The computer's still there. So all I could do basically now. I thought something was on there. Is do it from the phone. So here y'all have it. Y'all see it? Y'all see it? I had to make sure they get it though.
The Pepsi good. It's not. Uh, excuse me. It, excuse me. It ain't as like diesel like you. I wanted a cherry. And I I like the cherry Pepsi and I like vanilla. The the Pepsi vanilla. Is it? Yeah, I think it's just vanilla. I don't drink it as often, so you know I'm a little I, I don't know name of it because I don't drink it as often, but I know cherry. Anything cherry, I'm like, oh my mm. own. This is pretty good though. Mm, mm. Oh, chicken. Mm. Like I said, it's pretty good. I'm telling you, like, look, y'all gotta really look at the macaroni. Now, I'm gonna stand up on this now. I know I'm tall. Don't call me Big Bird. But I wanted y'all to see this, you know. Y'all, here, yeah, see? Lord Jesus, yes, yes. Y'all see that? Ah. Go ahead. See, like I'm nervous and junk. You know, I'm trying to hold my body weight and then trying to give you guys a piece. So, yeah, that's why I was shaking like that. <laughs> like, she, ooh. Yeah. A little tall, not too, too, too. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mm. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Let me see if I can bring y'all in some. Um, I said I'm gonna bring y'all in. Y'all seen that? I brought y'all in. But I wanted y'all to see it though. You know? See it all in all in one. Okay. Mm-hmm. 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 Look at that. Oh. Oh no. Let me make sure the light don't get too much. I'm telling y'all, that thing is, it is really good. Really good, like, really good. And the chicken not hard. Mm-mm-mm. Like I said, it's spicy. Ooh. Mm hmm I'm tired of feeding y'all. Y'all just dropping it everywhere. But no, he got them. So this thing is, I swear it's good. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> And it gave me enough amount of like chicken too. Woo. Mmm. 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 I don't know what really to say, guys. So it's, it's good. It's Wednesday. Come on. Oh. Y'all know Halloween is coming up. I know a lot of us got to go out and buy some Halloween costumes and all that other good stuff. Girl, I'm trying to get this stuff on the low. Nobody trying to spend all this money on the costume they're going to wear one time. Tell the truth now. Nah. I don't know if you guys seen our Halloween costume last year. What I was last year? I was just a door dasher. That was it. I just had my bag with my door dash shirt. And then I had my white tights and stuff on. Naya was... I think she just wore a dress. And then she had the sugar skull tattoos or uh, stickers on her face. <gasps> uh. oh, excuse me, y'all. Oh, um, Nehemiah was what... It was a ninja again. <clears throat> it was a green ninja. So where we went, we went to Krispy Kremes. I got some donuts. We went to two different Krispy Kremes because I'm greedy like that. <laughs> I went to the mall, got some candy. Yeah, we got candy from Krispy Kreme. 
I don't think that was it. They actually got a, a good amount of candy. They weren't supposed to get that much candy, so. Not that much, but they got enough candy. They got donuts. That's enough sweets. And it, then I took them home, and then I went to work afterwards, which wasn't bad. It was a good Halloween. It was peaceful, nice. I don't think nobody came, came to my house because a lot of trick-or-treaters were not walking the street, and I live in a dead end. So I don't think they were trying to come to my house anyways. But this year, I'm going to have it lit on this end if you get my feel. But I'm going to show you guys the decorations once we put them up sometime this week. Or I, either real, I will make a video of us putting them up, give or take, depending on, you know, what we got going on. If it's gonna, we going to have enough time or I don't know. It depends, you know. So... You guys will see the the ending results, but I'm trying to see should I show you guys how we actually are. Oh my god, this is really I, that's so strong. I, I thought it wasn't strong. I thought it was weak, but it, it is strong. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the ending result. But I'm not sure exactly if we're gonna make a vlog of it. Okay, that's what I was trying to say and try and get at. Because vlogs actually do take a lot of work. Like, if you don't finish the whole day with doing a whole bunch of stuff, you have to actually put a whole bunch of other things from different days together to cram, cram it up in to make a whole video. And it's like, I really don't want to do that. Because a lot of the times, I don't do that much at all. But go to work, to um, get the kids from school and stuff like that. Like, today, I really didn't do as much as I would have, you know, done. Like, on Mondays and Tuesdays are my slowest days. So, I'm washing clothes. I'm, um, you know, mop, sweeping and mopping. And then I'm straightening up the living room because the little person always has the living room. Messy, like always. Like, it's her room and it's not. She got all her stuff in here right now and I got to clean up. I, I haven't done that because I was doing some paperwork. I was getting away with, um... Basically, like I said, I was doing my paperwork and balancing out what I've spent so far for her daycare. And that was successful. I did that. I did that both of theirs. I evened it out for both of them so I know I overpaid money for them. And um, I did some other stuff. I did jotting down some notes and stuff and I did an application because, um, I don't know, because. You know, um, being an entrepreneur, you know, they do have their up and downs, especially what I do. So I figure I will, um, I need more of a supplement of income because of how things are. So, and then I like to be in the nursing field. I'd rather the nursing field rather than what I'm doing. I, I enjoy the people. I enjoy the company, talking with different people and seeing other people from different states and countries and stuff that comes over. And it's it's a blessing, I say. But then again, it takes a toll on you with being, you know, behind the wheel driving so long. So I feel I want to go back into the nursing thing and do the morning shift. I've done the morning shift. When I first started nursing, um, I've done it four times, which isn't bad. Probably, probably more than four times. Yeah, it was a full day shift, and then I did a night shift over into the day shift. Because if someone doesn't come in, you are uh, responsible for taking their position for just, I think, two extra hours until the next person can come in and relieve you. That was at the first nursing home I was at. So I used to do 16-hour shifts over there. Sometimes it used to be 13 hours. It depended. It, that right there was very tiresome because I do a 10 to 6, and then I end up doing a 10 to 10 and over until the next shift and two other shifts. Like, it's just a... It, it it was it was a lot. Just say it was a lot. But I enjoy doing it. I just don't want to do so many hours. You know, so I know now how to manage and tell the people verbally what I want, what I need from, you know, what to make me a better worker and don't be burnt out. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's why I think because I was really burnt out a lot of the time because if I had to run the floor, I was running the floor like I was an actual RN. And a lot of people think that I'm an RN. I'm not an RN. I'm a CNA. So I'm like... I would like to go back to school, but I'm not sure because Uber is offering full, um, a full scholarship to go to 
to Arizona State University. So I'm not sure if they offer that. So that's another thing that's in the play on. I would like to do as long as it's at home and, I, and it is at home online. So I'm going to look into that. Many, many, many things I would like to do and many, many things I would like to stop doing. And it's a whole ordeal, like I said. And for the holidays coming up, uh, there's a lot that's coming up. Like Thanksgiving, I don't think this year I'm going to celebrate. I don't think I'm going to cook this year for Thanksgiving because I don't have family that comes over. And I'm not going to Florida for Thanksgiving, even though my family has invited me and asked, well, actually invited me and um, asked if I wanted to come, which I'm not because, um, like I keep saying, like it, it, it puts a toll on me. It's like I would like for them to actually come and visit because I'm not that far. It's not an excuse for them not to come, but um, it is what it is. But this time I will not I've been to Florida this year alone I think three times three I think it was three times oh yes yeah, been three times last year was oh my god I don't know how many last year oh how many times I went to Florida I went to Florida three times last year so I think three or four times I'm not even sure because I had to go back and forth and getting the kids and getting them dropped off and meeting people halfway. So it's not a problem with meeting people halfway. I don't mind because the co-parenting for my kids is not hard at all. We have a great, great team together, you know, but neither who are there or whatever. You know, that's a different subject. But it's nothing complicated with that. But it's just, like I said, it puts a toll on you with all that driving and then in consideration with people, they want you to go here and there. I don't I don't mind it, but at the same time, it's just come on, folks. If I've driven 10 hours, what it is for you to actually you stay in the heart of Florida, you stay there already. What's the deal? Because I don't come often as uh, like you guys would think I would go to Miami as often, but I don't. So when I go, it's a treat for me and my kids. They know it and they love it. So here you go. There you go. There you have it. Okay. So this year I am done with the trips of going to Miami, but I would like to have a trip to go to Orlando, but it won't be a family thing. So I have a treat for you guys. So it's going to be something different. <sighs> Not no bay vacation either. Vacation. So don't be getting ideas like that, but um, it's going to be something. It's gonna be something. So I want. I would like to go to Orlando. Either I will stay here in Georgia. It don't matter. I'll either go to North Carolina, South Carolina. I got some things I would like to do as for myself as an individual, as a parent, because I need a break. You feel me? I need a break. <laughs> so I'm gonna end this video. I'm not gonna keep you guys any longer rambling that the mouth, telling you guys a whole bunch of stuff. But like I said, this macaroni and cheese. It is okay. I've never been a fan of KFC's macaroni and cheese. Never. And I will not start because it still tastes the same. It's not bad. But I, like I said, it's not like it's not like my macaroni and cheese. You know, I put like five cheeses in my thug. And I put bell peppers, onions. I make it like a... Um, well, somebody taught me, say my ex-husband taught me how to make macaroni and cheese. And I've made it that way since I, he showed me. And that's how my kids eat it. Like with the, it comes with bell peppers, onions. It comes with a five cheeses. And it comes with some other cheese that I put in there. But it's be banging. And then I bake that thing. It be so good. I'm telling you. I'm telling y'all good. I might end up doing it for you guys. And then you guys tell me how, you know whatever but yeah they macaroni cheeses now i've never been a fan but hey it is what it is toshe toshe to each his own if you love their macaroni cheese go out and get the bowl because baby it is good with the chicken i would say is the best on in this bowl mm. but Y'all can have the rest. Go ahead and have it. I had enough. And it was been good for what it is. For what it was. 
So. So for all who are looking for more sandwiches coming, I'm not going to do any more sandwiches. I was thinking about it and I was like, okay, I broke my little diet thing that I, it wasn't even a diet, it's just me cutting out bread and cutting out sugar. So I'm going to go back to where I was because October is coming, November is rolling, and guess what? The pounds are rolling too, but actually I lose like one pound a week. One or two pounds a week, which isn't bad because I don't work out, but I work around the house, if you get what I'm saying, you know? So, I'm going to get back into my regiment. Did I say it right? A regiment? I don't know if I said it right. You know, a lot of my words don't even sound right half of the time. So, yeah. I'm going to get back into it. Um, exercising at home. Going to the gym? Uh-uh. Because um, the gym by my house, nah, I'm okay. Nah, I might. That's what's going to be the whole time me being at the gym. And I'd rather save myself the time, trouble, and the headache and just do it at home in a peaceful way in front of my television right by my couch in my room. Because I got a lot of room in my, in my bedroom that I can actually just exercise and feel comfortable without feeling uncomfortable. If you get what I'm saying, ladies. But into who we'll see you guys later. Make sure you subscribe, like, share this video, comment down below because hey, I'm being I'm being here with you guys throughout the week. We need to do this together because I think this is a healing thing for me, especially. I like doing the videos. Actually love doing the videos for you guys because I get to see the reactions and comments down below. So I am so happy for the ones that have been staying here and that have been commenting. For the ones that haven't commented, you still, I still thank you for still being here and watching me. So I'll see you guys on the next video. See you guys Thursday. We're going to be, we are at the end of the week. Trust and behold, you're going to make it. We both going to make it. And now you guys have a blessed one. See you guys later. Uh, get in there.